sure you don't eat back there either. All right, guys, good morning. It is Dorothy with Six Day Ranch. I want to give y'all an update on the work that we did over the past couple days with the pigs. As you can see, they have made a hole and they moved one of the pieces of concrete out. Stop biting my boot. And some of the concrete's been moved. Stop it, Jules. No. I'm gonna feed the goats, but, or the pigs, but they think that their pig feed is theirs. No. And the pigs are hungry, that's why they're squealing. So they moved the concrete around. We've gotta get that fixed. Excuse me, Billy. And I don't know if you can see, but their hole is actually holding water, which is great. I know, I'm gonna feed you. You ran out this morning. When they run out of food, they're moody. They need their food. So we're gonna get that taken care of real quick, and I'll see you in just a minute. She keeps, she keeps being able to put her head right in there. And we obviously don't want that. So what I'm gonna do is come back at a later date and put some hardware cloth on either side of the feeder. Look, there she goes. She's gonna get her head stuck. So we're gonna put some hardware cloth on either side so that way that doesn't happen anymore. I'm gonna go check, really. I'm gonna go check on the other animals and then I think that's all we've got for you today. I don't know. We're gonna go check on everybody else, make sure they have good, plenty of food and water, and I'll show you the meat chicks. So we'll see you in just a minute. So everyone has been doing extremely well. Um, I forgot to tell you, the temperature is only the high of 90 today. I know that seems like a lot, but it's way better than what it has been. Usually it's in like the hundreds, and we are actually starting to get some more breezes in the afternoons, which feels great. Also, at the end of next week, we looked and like the lows are in the 60s, higher the 80s. So we're getting there. We're getting to those fall's temperatures. Good morning. Y'all are always sitting on eggs. I think you're going to hatch some eggs. I think that's what you're going to do. We're going to let you too. Hi. I'm not going to mess with your eggs. They're good on food. And I gave them water yesterday. And so they drank it to here, which is actually really good. So they're good on water. And then because everybody's been free ranging, I feel the ducks have feed and they have water too and they eat out of the ducks feed because we leave their door open as well and then we also have our two extra waters out in the middle of the open to where they have water during the day excuse me without having to go all the way out to the coop and look at these guys okay you're just hiding under the water so guys we got 36 the other day when we opened the box we haven't lost a single one not one which is really surprising it's actually really good but everybody's got food everybody's got water there over there taking a dust bath next to mr rooster little foot's in there in the duck pan and i'm actually having them clean this for me because we're it's supposed to be hung and steven's gonna come back no you don't need to be in there ah you don't she still made it in so we're, I'm just kind of let them eat all the food that's out of that so I can get it cleaned down and uh, we can get it hung when we get the automatic waterers and misters and stuff. Come on. 
Go that way. Right there, through the door. Don't be dumb. There you go. And there's the ducks. Oh, you're not a duck. I thought you were a duck. There's the two ducks. <laughs> the other ducks are around here somewhere. So, this was a really short video. We're happy with the turnout on the pig's water situation. It's not perfect, they did move the concrete, but we can move that back. That's not near as bad as digging as much as we did the last week. So, hopefully it'll stay that way and it'll get better. Um, I'm gonna keep you guys updated on that and I'll show you how we secure the hardware cloth to the other side of it because that doesn't rust as fast as chicken wire. We have a feeling that they would be able to rust or just bust through that chicken wire. So if you guys like this really short video, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button down below and we'll see you next time.